Hello friends, welcome to Ankita's kitchen and today we are making palak puri. It is a nice twist to a simple puri recipe with some spinach and a wine. Let's go through the ingredients before we start. So, we will need spinach, flour, green chilies, oil, carom seeds or a wine, turmeric powder, asafoetida, salt to taste, oil to deep fry and water. start with soak spinach in boiling water for a minute this is because we want to soften the spinach before we grind it after a minute drain the spinach out and grind it along with green chilies our spinach mixture is ready now in a bowl take flour then spinach mixture carom seeds asafoetida turmeric powder salt and oil after mixing everything knead it into a firm dough add more water or flour if needed now the dough is ready add a tablespoon of oil and mix it in to prevent the dough from drying out Take a small piece of dough and press it between your fist to smooth out any cracks. Then make a ball. Now roll it out using a rolling pin. We want these puris to be a bit thicker than rotis to puff up nicely while frying. After all puris are rolled out, we are ready to fry them. But before adding puris, check the oil temperature, add a small piece of dough, and if it comes back to surface in no time like this, you know oil is ready. Now, add puri into the oil one at a time for beginning. After that, you can add 2 to 3 puris for this much of oil. As this puri comes to surface, push it down gently to increase air pockets and puff it up. As puri gets white shine on top, turn it over and cook the other side. Now this puri is ready. It should take less than a minute to cook a puri. If it is taking more time, then oil might not be hot enough now fry the rest of the puris same way we did the first one now puris are ready serve it with some vegetable or pickle i hope you like this video do subscribe for more videos like this and thank you for watching